It is no secret that the gameplay experience of Honkai Star Rail is great, but if someone looked over your shoulder and saw you playing the game, would it look interesting to them? Now this may sound like a stupid question, but think about it for a second. Is there any promotional material for Honkai Star Rail which showcases the gameplay in depth? Most of the time it is cutscenes and other cinematics with narration in the background. But if the gameplay is so good, then why does Hoyo not show it when advertising the game? That is pretty simple. The combat UI is minimalistic and mostly static. Combine it with the characters having no idle animations in combat and you have something that looks boring and cheap. Now I understand that the UI has to be suitable for the smaller screen of a mobile phone, so it is not reasonable to expect persona level of complexity with the UI, but I still think that it could be easily improved, and this is what I want to talk about in this video. Let's begin with something simple, like the character portraits at the bottom of the screen. Currently they just sit there. However, I should note that the portrait of the character that you are controlling is enlarged, as if you were not aware already by looking at your screen. But we can take this useless feature and turn it to something better. What if the portrait of the current character was not only enlarged but was also animated in a similar fashion to how some of the promotional material for light cones is. It is a small detail but it would add to the overall look of the game, and if Hoyo wanted to take it further they could give the characters different expressions on the portrait based on their status. For example they receive healing, they smile, they are on low HP, they look tired, they are enraged, the portrait depicts them being angry, etc. Another way they could improve the visual experience is by giving additional indication for when the character charges their ultimate. For example, the character could have a faint aura around them with the energy being full to the point where it starts to overflow. Even someone that has no clue about turn-based games in general would be able to look at the character on the screen and notice the aura, grabbing their attention before pulling off the cool looking ultimate. They can also be more subtle by making the eyes of the character faintly glow when their ultimate is ready. The same treatment can be applied to the portrait for consistency and looks. Now that suggestion does not directly address the combat UI but make directly tied to it and well every other part of the game. I am talking about the loading screens. Let's be honest, Hoyo is not winning any prize with the loading screen. It is functional, but it could be made a lot better with minimal effort. And while this is not a problem on my PC where the loading screens are very short, it can be a big factor to people who play the game casually on their phone and want to show the game to their friends. But as soon as you have to go to a cool looking area, they have to look at Pom Pom walking to the right for 10 seconds before getting to show off anything. How do we solve it? Let's establish that getting rid of the loading screens or making them shorter is out of the question. With that in mind, what I would do to make the loading screens less mind numbing is put either screenshots or artwork relevant to the the area you're traveling to. For example, when you travel to Hero Space Station, you see freeze frames with cutscenes that occurred on the space station in the past. Alternatively, if the player has not seen enough cutscenes or if the player chooses to, they can have artwork of the characters appear instead. So while teleporting to the space station, you can see artwork for Hera, Asta or Arlen while the game is loading. Furthermore, they can take it a step further and have a small competition every so often to have your phone already be featured in the game as a loading screen. The players would be recompensated with in-game goodies as well as being credited for the artwork, for example by having some text in the top corner of the screen saying buy XYZ. This solution not only encourages more fan art to be created but it also solves the initial problem of loading screens being boring. Two birds with one stone. I am interested as to what you guys think about these suggestions. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoy this style of content, I try to get one of these videos out every Friday. Until then, goodbye.